to, in the world, doesn't matter, to step up and to show themselves proud with everything it is, it doesn't matter. Uh, so we had people from classes, but also people at home, that filmed, them, filmed themselves to show the world, hey, I have Parkinson's, or I have a partner with Parkinson's, or, or whatever, and I'm beautiful, and I'm there. And um, this is a, a small compilation, so you can start the film of what we did receive from, from everywhere. Proud that with all the people we connect with that help us make it possible not only here, uh, not only in Holland, but also, for example, here, that like minded people we are able to do this good work because not work is about changing people's life. This is only a short, short uh, result of everything we received from everywhere. It was uh, uh, unbelievable what we did get, what the people sent to us. Um, what we do is not a therapy. What we do is also not taking the disease away. Because it's there. And we can fight it, but then it will be like being a boxer that steps into a boxing ring and finds out that there is no opponent in front of you, that you don't have gloves to fight him, that you didn't train for this competition uh, game, but that the opponent is inside of you. And if you would start to fight yourself, you can only lose. So it's about letting it be. It's there. Whatever, give it place. It will take space more and more and more. And every time you have to adjust, it's difficult, but it's possible. The nice thing, the good thing, is about when you don't fight it, but you start to make a duet with him or her, with yourself, then, then, then the most important thing happens. Because then you are really able to dive into yourself, to give yourself space, to love yourself, whatever it is. And it uh, uh, doesn't matter if I move like this, if I move like this, if I move doesn't matter. It's beautiful. Recognizing this and, and being able to surrender, not to the Parkinson's, but to the dance, then it will still be difficult in life, but we will be able to get through life. And not only we, the patient, the dancer, but with us, the partner, the family, the friend, that's all suffering from what, what's happening to us. That's the beauty of what we do, because I know that in, also here in auditorium people know what I'm talking about. And the nice thing is that we, after five years now that I'm running together with Rosan, this foundation, we are at the point that we don't have to carry it ourselves anymore, but that's carrying itself. What started 
for me to move myself has become a movement in, in itself. And it's, 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 it's going through the world. We're now here because in, this is the very special moment where uh, Natalie and I, the step up for Parkinson's and then for Health, start a long-term collaboration because we connect, we, we know what to do, why we do it, and it's our personal drive. And with this, we are, and Natalie, especially here in Malta, is able to, do, to make this possible here, to have me over here to tell you that she's doing the good work here and that we will, together, start developing more and more and more for more people. Because the training of my body with the balance and the coordination is one thing. The changing my perspective in being able to, to, to look differently and not being a patient but a, but a dancer, it's all very important. But then the most important thing after, after that is that we need to keep on innovating developing, developing our movement, working with artists, not as therapy, but as artists, to continuously change, because if we won't, then it will be a, become a gym, a, a, a movement uh, which won't work, because it's about art, it's about emotion, it's about expression. That's what we started in, in Rotterdam. The, we call it the House for Dance and Health. It's an expertise center where we develop within the front line our dancers, they're the experts that know what it does, but we bring in dancers and choreographers that work with them to see what happens to develop movement. I can move like this, but I can also move freely in space, and I can find things that you probably didn't think about before. Doesn't matter. That's what we do, and that's what we're going to develop together more and more and more, so that um, this, what is, what is still moving, will, will be moving also for the upcoming years. Um, now I'm lost a little bit. Then I start dancing, then it happens. How much time do I have? Yeah, almost, yeah, okay. That's good. Because I'm al almost uh, finished. Um, Actually, one of the only things I can say at the moment is if I could not reach you tonight and then that you could feel a little bit about what we do and the importance of what we do, then you're probably always welcome to join a class, to experience what, 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 what we're doing with Natalie, um, with our dancers over here in Malta. Uh, uh, because that's uh, actually the only question I have from me to you tonight is that please, if you really, if you believe anything of what I've said today is true, then share it to whoever wants to know and then try, especially the people that are in need for it, to get them to the dance class, to the studio. Because for us, maybe the, for people with Parkinson's disease or with people with multiple sclerosis or arthritis, which we also developed already program for. For them, for us, it's the, when you don't know, that you don't know you can dance, it's the, the thing that's the most far away from your, your imagination that you ever could do. So help them to persuade them to come for once to the studio and try. Because I know if they come, like I did, to the studio and experience this, freedom and beauty, being happy in the body, that they will, will keep on coming, keep on enjoying, and laughing through life and dancing through life. I want to finish now tonight with uh, one last film from uh, the Dance for Health organization before we go also to the Step of Parkinson's. Um, and that's a, a one minute short trailer of a performance that we made with Christine de Chatel, choreographer, famous choreographer in Holland. We worked with 11 of our dancers, with Parkinson, arthritis and rheumatism. We did a little tour in Holland in the theaters. She approached us. She saw the beauty. We 
Lee Dallas Cards on Air Valley. It's pure, it's dense. Thank you. <laughs>